hello everyone welcome to video number four in this video i'm going to talk about how to select a rs232 module which is principally the mediation device or the level shifter uh, and we have already discussed that uh, we need these uh, level shifters or the mediation device so that our arduino can uh, talk with the inverter which is rs232 so let's look at uh, first this is these are the level shifter boards and uh, uh, one of these i think this one uh, at the top over here is also the i2c device so how these works and it, these also have i think this txt and rxt leds also i haven't used them uh, they are available I'm just sharing that you can use these if I am going to test these and if it is successful I will share my experience but right now I don't have the experience I have uh, got these boards but I have not tested these so this is one option you have and uh, right now I am using this uh, module uh, RS232 module uh, with my Arduino uh, this is a complete module uh, with the connector this I think called DB9 or something. Um, so this is easy to use with the already provided cable uh, by the company with inverter. So all I have to do is uh, connect the wires with Arduino and it start working. So what I have found out that uh, there are two types of chips um, in these modules. One is MX3232 and the other is SP3232. Um, MX3232 uh, is cheaper and uh, SP3232 is um, is, is uh, so called industrial level uh, uh, chip but I haven't seen any uh, difference in the usage because uh, I try to use SP3232 so, so that maybe the problems I am facing is due to MX3232 but there was no um, issue and i could not resolve the problem so uh, mx3232 which is cheaper is just fine and you can see that these module uh, comes with uh, male and female connectors because our uh, cable the cable provided with the uh, inverter is uh, lan and the other side db9 is female so i uh, suggest you to get this uh, male ones so this is easy to connect you don't need any uh, gender changer like uh, these are the gen gender changers so uh, uh, this mini gender changes changes the female to male and uh, there are two there are of two types simple gender changer uh, which changes the just changer but then there is a, another another one that is called also null modem so what does this null modem do it also replaces the rx and tx uh, pins that's what we need when we uh, want to change the gender because with gender the receiving and transmitting pins also change so um, uh, null modem should be used if you have this um, if you by chance got the other module then you will need this null modem gen gender changer I haven't used it but I think if I try this it will work um, then uh, th there is another concept of DCE and DTE you need to understand uh, I don't have a very in-depth knowledge of this con this thing but uh, uh, I will try to explain what I know um, maybe the problems I am facing right now is due to misunderstanding of this concept but let me share my knowledge uh, DT E is the data terminal equipment and DCE is the data communication equipment um, generally the male ones are generally it's not uh, 100 at 100 uh, percent it at times you can get female but uh, the male ones are generally the DTE type and uh, uh, the, the, these are present on your PC and on the modern side uh, they are the DCE and they are the female types and the if if pin 3 has voltage on it then it is dte 
otherwise it is DCE. So um, this is uh, another concept. This will be helpful when you are applying this uh, uh, this solution. So this module uh, right now this should be DTE and the and the cable uh, with the with the inverter that should be DC. This is my understanding. This is I may be wrong, but uh, this is all <laughs> I have learned so far. So what I recommend is I recommend you to get a, a MX3232 module uh, with a male DB9 connector and uh, that should have also have RX and TX LEDs on it. Uh, that is important and uh, I will uh, share why that is important in my uh, next videos um, because this will these LEDs really help us resolving the issues uh, while communicating. So this is the recommendation, get a um, MX3232 module, uh, module, not uh, level shifter, um, because these level shifters uh, also have these chips, uh, MX3232 and SP3232. So get this module uh, right now, you can see here, this is the uh, receiving LED. Uh, I will share a lot of, uh, about this. So get this module, uh, mail, MX3232 with RX and TX LEDs. So I think that is all from now. Uh, let's meet in the next video.